Well, hello everyone and welcome to the Autodesk Robot Structural Analysis Professional 2022 tutorial brought to you by the Civil Engineering Essentials channel. In this video, we're going to cover the GUI or graphical user interface of Autodesk Robot. Now, assuming that you have downloaded, installed and activated Autodesk Robot, when you start Autodesk Robot, this is the first thing that you will see. Um, well, on the right side there are notifications in case Autodesk has updates or interesting news to share, the recent projects, uh, all the files that you have recently worked with, and finally you have on the left side the new project uh, toolbar, and there are like multiple presets to open from. I'm gonna take the building design preset to just start up robot and take a look on the GUI of this software. <clears throat> you can see that it is dominated by this light blue area, which is basically the area where you will be drawing stuff. You will be modeling your structures here, analyzing them, adding loads, designing them in this blue area, the central area, your view area. You have on the left side the object inspector, which lists all the objects yeah, that you have defined. Sometimes it's pretty useful when you want to select one object amongst a hundred of objects. It's quite easy to select from here. Also, if you select an object, the properties of that object are going to pop up here, which you can change if you want, or you can use different tools to change those properties. On the right side, and this is the most important toolbar, are the drawing and modeling tools. Now, those are not all the tools, because as you can see here, you have a lot of uh, possible tools to model your structures from. However, those are usually the most relevant and are listed in a quiet, um, logical way. Um, there are also here some graphical shortcuts which enable you to show or hide different aspects of your model. Of course, you can always access them in more detail by going to the display settings. And basically, this is a generalized way of changing your display um, preferences. Now, this is something we will cover later. Um, all of those things are going to be covered later in other videos. But this is just a general introduction video to the GUI of Autodesk Robot. Now the top toolbar, there is the selection toolbar where you can select different elements according to their nodes or points or whatever. Also you can select different stories and those are once again tools that will be explained in different and separate videos. Um, to finalize the toolbars, you have the uppermost toolbar as you can see. Well, on the left half of this toolbar are your basic instruments like saving, opening, undo, redo. And in the central part is your calculation or analysis button and this is used to start your analysis and to perform your analysis uh, this is something that we will cover later uh, finally you have your view tools and your tools toolbox which opens the preferences of the software itself something that we will cover in yet another video of course this is only the tip of the iceberg and that's it that's a very general quick view of the autodesk robot graphical user interface and of course, there is a lot more from, from where that came from. If you like this video, please consider subscribing and giving a thumbs up or sharing this video. It helps a lot. Uh, thank you very much. This is the Civil Engineering Essentials channel, and we will see you in future videos.